up everyone uh, today I'm gonna be working on the 240SX uh, maybe by the time you watch this video I'll, I'll be ready on the 300 subscribers thank you guys remember to please comment like and subscribe subscribe to the YouTube channel it means a lot to me but yeah guys I'm gonna be working today on the 240SX uh, my fitment on the rear it sucks it's not like it's not how I want it to be but yeah guys uh, stay tuned Fam, we're gonna be working on the 240SX the fitment it's not how I like it uh, I don't know if you guys can tell see how the rear sits it's like it's a little bit more up than the other side the other side uh, it's lower by a couple inches so I don't know if you guys can tell so I'm uh, I'm going to fix that right now. I'm just gonna take off the wheels, uh, chuck up the car, and try to make it even from the other side. There, yeah, guys. I'm gonna be doing that. Stay tuned. Let's get the jack. All right, we've got all the tools I need. This torque wrench. Lift up the car. Make sure you lose the lug nuts before you lift up the car. All right, let's get it. We just find a place where we can lift up the car, and then we'll be good to go. Coming from the bottom, what you know about that? Whole team getting on, that's a fact. I've been smoking green so long that my lungs might collapse. Whole life still smoking that pack, smoking that gas. Yeah, so loud you can smell it through the bag. Yeah, get down and I try not to brag. Whole team stay high, getting that jet lag. I don't ever say blips, I don't even sweat that. Up all night, I don't stop. Yeah, the neighbors might call the cops. Music loud, yeah, we rock. Yeah. Turn it down, probably not Middle figures up like fuck that We don't give a fuck and I love that Big drip, no with a mug I think uh, we're gonna go a little bit lower On this side And for that I think We need to lose this Loosen up this thing And bring it a little bit lower I think I might need a little bit uh, Like a 5mm spacer Cause my wheel is hitting on the coilover Look at that shit. It's already eating that stuff. But yeah, um, so yeah, let's lower it a little bit more. And uh, I don't know if you guys remember on my G37 how I did it to get uh, the the fitment right. How I lower it. So I'm gonna lower it, count the lines. We're gonna go on the other side and do the same thing. Cool. All right, I already went a little bit a little bit down. So we're gonna make sure and count the lines. I'm gonna check how many lines I have right here and go to the other side and do the same thing. All right guys, so on this side we went uh, 85 lines. So I'm just gonna go to the other side and count the same thing so that it can be even. Yeah, we rock, yeah. Turn it down, probably not. Middle figures up like fuck that. We don't give a fuck and I love that. Big drip, no way to mud that. Pour one up, double cup. I know when it's popping, yeah. I know when it's popping, yeah. I know when it's popping, like show that she drive it, yeah. And I let her drive it, yeah. I know when it's popping, I know when it's popping, yeah. I know when it's popping, yeah. You know that I got it. So before we had. On this one, on the passenger side, 90 lines. Now we have 80. <laughs> on the driver's side, we had 85. Now we have 80. So we should be good to go. When it's popping, yeah. You know that I got it, you know that I got it. Yeah. I know when it's popping, yeah. I know when it's popping, I know when it's popping. Alright, we're done. We're just gonna lower the car and see how it stands. Let's see. All right, that's how it sits right now, but we have uh, bricks on the bottom. 
Uh, quita la de... Ahí está, güey. Ahí está, güey. Oh, aquí está, güey. Vamos a echarlo para atrás. That's how this hits. Bricks. We're gonna bring it down and see if uh, it changes. I think it went up a little bit. So by looking at it, I think I need to go a little bit more low on this side because check the other side. It's fucking low as fuck. Yeah, so I'm gonna lower it from the back, from the passenger side a little bit more, so it can be the same. All right, we finally got the fitment right. It's flush, perfect. No complaints at all. Should be good. I went ahead and grabbed this uh, NRG steering wheel. It's pretty simple, it's nothing crazy, and it's not expensive. I only paid like a hundred bucks shipped. And I mean, it's all good, it will do the job. This is uh, the other one that I have right now, which is like complete shit. Like, I've seen this online, and I think it's only like 25 bucks from 25 bucks from eBay or something like that so it's all fucked up it moves around and yeah I'm gonna change yes. it right now there it is install was like 10 maybe five minutes it car already came with a quick release in, uh, setup and stuff so it was really easy uh, just to swap out uh, the steering wheel but yeah uh, that's it guys and yeah, the video is kind of short. Uh, I don't know if you. Uh, I'm gonna go and uh, give it a car wash. It's really dirty. What you guys can tell I me. Mean, this car's really needs a wash. Look at this. There it is guys, looks amazing. Let's go get the car car wash and then we'll see what happens. Alright, let's give our first drive on the new steering wheel. I mean feels amazing to have a new steering wheel. <laughs> the other one it was like really old. So I mean it's not bad. I mean a hundred bucks for a nice pretty good with the rest stitching wish I can get a carbon fiber one but uh, not at the moment <laughs> all right so let's go to the car wash so yeah guys I don't know what the issue is with the the other side of the passenger side uh, I'll try to fix it later. For now, that's it.
keep subscribing guys and see you to the next video I don't take setbacks, no time for that Staying high, getting by, I got a mind for that And I'm never ungrateful for things that I had I look at life and I smile, I laugh Saying the prayer